Hi y'all, welcome to Beer Betty's. My name is Senya. And I'm Whitney Jones. And today we will be trying some Full Sail. So what are we trying today, Whitney? Well, this is actually a really cool series that Full Sail has started. This is their limited series, or LTD series as they're calling it. It's also supposed to stand for Live the Dream. Um, really cool background story on Full Sail, actually. It started in 1987. They were located in Hood River, Oregon. And actually, their claim to fame is that they are the first commercially successful brewery to bottle in the Pacific Northwest for for profit, you know. So uh, that was kind of a big step for uh, home brewers and microbrewers everywhere in that area. Um, this actually is recipe number five. Uh, they have a few different recipes. Now, what they're pretty much doing is that they're taking the very American amber ale and they're kind of making it their own so to say trying to take it back from those big brewer corporations who they feel have just pretty much bastardized the product and <laughs> make it something that's a little bit more creative um another cool thing that i've noticed about this product is with each recipe since it's different they have actually taken the time to um put the recipe on the bottom of the box. It shows you what kind of malts and hops they're using, what kind of water they're using. It's pretty cool. So if you pick one of these up, make sure you get it in the box so you can look at the recipe. But you ready to try it? Yeah. All right. Do you want to open it? Or do you want oh, to... okay. by all means. Oh, I should have had you open it. Oh, loose threads disintegrate. <laughs> That's what it says. I just like on the top how it says uh, a brew that'll twist your cap. <laughs> oh, and we apologize, Full Sail. We don't have any Full Sail glasses. Feel free to send us some, though. Oh, yes, absolutely. <laughs> we are kind of limited in our glassware. I love the color. It's got a real nice dark amber color. And it's very clear. Mm -hmm. There you are. Thank you. Mm. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Ooh. Like, off the nose, I can really get... You can smell the hops a little bit. It's not too overpowering. And there's a little bit of a citrus note. It's a very clean. And almost, um, you know, they do use a little bit of chocolate and caramel malt in this recipe. And you can kind of smell it in the back. I get the chocolate you malt. Know? Oh, yeah. You really taste that chocolate malt. Mmm. Oh. Yeah. You can. Oh, that really... That is not what I was expecting. It's... Got a very nice bitter flavor at the end, but it starts off with a slightly sweet. You get that mm -hmm. real. I guess it's because of the chocolate malts, or maybe what was the other thing you said they used? They use chocolate and caramel malt as well as just the regular malt that they would usually put in their lagers. It, I'm really impressed by this. I absolutely love it actually, and usually I I usually stray away from lagers, but yeah, it's mainly just because you usually have very overprocessed lagers and they did a really good job of making this their own so yay full sale <laughs> yay this is the winner taking so, lager back from the big companies <laughs> so uh, what would you rate this out of a six pack would you drink the whole six pack could you i would drink the whole six pack like honestly i would do either a 5.5 to a six it's you could eat drink this with anything too which is the best part this could be a barbecue beer this could also be your beer that you just sit down and just drink this you know it's 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 a great product. It really is. Well, I can't is. stop drinking it, so I'm definitely going to give it a six-pack. <laughs> this is, well, I would say a five out of six-pack, because I don't mm. know if I could drink that much, but I would definitely give it a five out of a six-pack. It's delicious. I totally could. This mm. is amazing. <laughs> well, thanks, Whitney, for uh, the information on Full sale. Oh, no problem. Anytime. <laughs> Catch us next time when uh, we're not sure what beer we're going to be tasting, and but hopefully we have the right glasses for it. Possibly, but hey, you know, no matter what beer we're tasting, we know we're going to enjoy it. So thanks for joining us. Cheers. Cheers.